I'll see you around, Shepard. No doubt. So. Hello. Commander Shepard, welcome to the Citadel. Oh, thank you. No. This <clears throat> is Docking Bay D24. Uh -huh. Note that due to recent events, official identification and weapons permits may be requested by CSAC personnel for routine verification. Would be fucking do. Any other important areas I should know about? Docking Bay E24 has been repurposed into temporary housing to accommodate the recent influx of civilians to the Citadel. If you wish to contact your species' official Citadel representative, please go to Citadel Embassies. For medical needs, the Presidium offers leading-edge care at the Huerta Memorial Hospital. It's a the very Presidium small, very have been a cultural hospital. mainstay since the Council was first established at the Citadel. What's with the heightened security? New screening fields have been added in order to speed up processing at the security stations in each docking area. Citadel security screening technology uses highly advanced biometric authentication systems developed by the CERTA Foundation. Hmm. Please note that any attempt to circumvent Citadel security the CERTA survived the fiscal year. Incarceration. What else is in the area? You are standing in docking area D24. According to your biometrics file, you are cleared to access further information about this bay. Lovely. This is the airlock currently assigned to the Systems Alliance ship Normandy. If you look out the bay window, you can see one of the many magnificent vistas for which the Citadel is renowned. <laughs> what about that room over there? Glad I don't really The care. waiting area is for those who wish to speak to our new arrivals. It is located next to security processing. What else is in here? You are standing. This is. If you look out the bay window, you can see one of the many magnificent vistas for which the Citadel is renowned. Any other important areas? Docking Bay E24 has been. If you wish to come for med, the Presidium Commons has been a. All right. That's all. All right. Please all right. All right. You got nothing. Okay. First deployment is somewhere near Paladin. Report Ten thousand. Now I'm getting some money. Thirty-five thousand. Did Commander Shepard escape? Your camera is racing the wrong direction, woman. Ma'am, I can't talk about that. You don't have to, Commander Shepard. Yeah. What do you want? What's going on here? Commander, just who I was looking for, Diana Allers, Alliance News Network. I think we can help each other. I suppose you wanted an interview. Even better. I'm a military reporter with a show called Battle Space. We're carried on just about all council planets. My producers want me embedded on a human ship, and I want that ship to be the Normandy. Why would I want that? Wars yeah. can be won or lost in the editing room, and this war needs to be won. I've got Alliance security clearance and operate without a crew. You get veto power over the segments I file. Can you handle an arrangement Should like that? Should make his skin a bit darker because I keep he looking? looks fucking retarded like this. Mm, looks sick, Shepard. Tell your producers yes, for now. We'll see how it works out. Report to the ship as soon as possible. Any questions? How much gear can I bring? One foot logger. Aye, aye, Commander. I'll just say that Shepard has been to a tanning salon, and I'll be uh, legit. I have an editor, so it should be okay. This is also quite a story. So, the nurse tells me you've refused to bathe and you only want to talk to another Asari. Yes. Can I have a gun? I'm sorry. No. Maybe I could be transferred to another hospital then. Someplace unsecured. I could have a gun then, right? And no humans. And wherever you transfer me, it, it, it shouldn't have humans. The humans are our allies. You don't trust them? No, it's not that. I... How are my eyes? What, what, what color are they right now? 
Maybe you could tell me what happened. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe not. Welcome to Serta. You, I will need. Serta is a non-profit organization dedicated <coughs> to medical needs of all sapiens. The collected types. elephant. Mm -hmm. All profits from sales go to help new medical research. Yeah, let's buy that. Whatever. I'm a nice guy. Hey, how are you two doing? Here's Shepard now. Dr. Chocolate. All right. Here? I'm working at an Alliance R&D lab down in Shouter Woods, coordinating closely with Admiral Hackett. I heard you escaped Earth in the Normandy and that someone was critically injured. I came as fast as I could. We had a run-in with a Cerberus synthetic on Mars. Ashley took the worst of it. How's she doing? Very well, all things considered. I'm impressed with Lieutenant Commander Williams' resilience, as well as Dr. Michelle's expertise. I wish I could have been there to help on Mars. It's been six months, Doctor. How have you been? It was fake interest. Good. I've been in fortunate. <coughs> when they impounded Normandy, the Alliance didn't really know what to do with me. I was never officially part of Cerberus, and I'd gotten a proper leave of absence from my previous post. So you hadn't technically done anything wrong by joining me to defeat the Collectors? Yes, though I suppose if you were judged to be a war criminal, I would have been tried as an accessory. Your place is in Normandy's med bay, not some lab. I couldn't agree more. You say the word, and I'm with you. The Normandy wouldn't be the same without you, Doctor. Get your things. Docking bay D24. Yes, Commander. And thank you. Hey, you will. Don't thank me so soon. Remember, Joker is still aboard. And I'd be surprised if he's been remembering his medication. Meh. Alright, let's talk to... Oh, see, that shit happens every once in a while. Hello, Commander Shepard. Welcome to Huerta Memorial Hospital. That's why I've got those other tweaks installed as well. The human officer in charge is Dr. Michel. Also, please note that specialists for all known Citadel species are on call. Please ensure that you observe proper decontamination protocols at all times while in this area. Uh, no. You can really cover treatment for any kind of species here? Huerta Memorial surpasses all requirements needed for any multi-species medical facility. This facility's attendant levels can also replicate the living conditions needed to accommodate other, more exotic species. Aquatic environments, for example, are available on short notice. What about the medical staff? How do they deal with so many species? All personnel are required to undergo mandatory and regular psychological evaluations, as well as refresher courses. Hospital administration okay. understands how difficult it can be for staff to deal with such a wide variety of patients. It is imperative they be offered the support needed to retain their current high standards. Dang. Where'd the hospital get its name? It is named after President Christopher Huerta of Earth's United North American States. The donor who requested the tribute expressed the desire to remain anonymous. No, right, whatever. What else is in the area? The Huerta Memorial Hospital has experts from every major race and residency, with many specializing in Xeno medicine. The facility works with prestigious medical universities from around the galaxy, offering internships to residents and nurses. With access to cutting-edge technology and support from major pharmaceutical companies, the hospital ensures the best care to its patients. Lovely. Thank you. Please speak with me again. It's a very small hospital. <laughs> I think that's funny. Hey, Dr. Michelle. Commander Shepard, good to see you. Dr. Michelle, it's been a long time. You've come a long way from that small clinic down in the wards. Because of you, I don't know where I'd be if you hadn't dealt with Fist and his thugs. Now I'm med physician in a Presidium clinic. You gave me this chance. I assume you're here about Lieutenant Commander Williams? Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. How's Ashley doing? French Canadian. The trauma was severe, but we reduced the swelling quickly. Oh, no. These types of injury can go either way. She hasn't regained consciousness yet, but... 
Her vitals are strong, so I'm optimistic. You can go see her if you like. She's just down the hall. How are your medical supplies holding up? We're well stocked now, but I can't say I'm not worried about the future. We've posted guards on our reserves. War profiteering has already begun. Yeah. For a center of this size, you must have a lot of direct reports. We've got 12 full-time doctors and over 50 support staff. It can be overwhelming, quite different from my days in the wards. Hmm. This war may leave a lot of injured people homeless. Can the Citadel clinics care for them all? We're fine now, but I'm worried. Every hospital in the Citadel is preparing for the worst. I hear the docks are tightly controlled, but we just can't leave people floating out there forever. Keep up the good work, Doctor. You too, Commander. All right. Let's uh, go around a bit. Still the best course of action. I'll see if we have the required spatial bindings. Meet you back here. And now they just stand there. Nobody wants to make the first move. It's all game of honor. Hi, Doctor. Didn't expect to see you again so soon. Well, we need to prescribe you another round of antibiotics. For when I ship out? I have some bad news. Your squad applied the metagel correctly, but infection had already set in by the time they found you. I'm sorry. I'm afraid we have to remove your legs below the knee. What? But... I... I... I don't understand it. It doesn't even hurt. It would if we took you off the painkillers, Lieutenant. Ooh. Sucks to be you. Well, we got prosthetics for that. I'm sure they're very good in the future. You got pretty banged up there, Williams. Had me worried. I just wanted to check in on you. See how you're doing. You hang in there, all right? I need you up and reporting for duty ASAP. You hear me, soldier? You need anything, Doc. Let me know. Okay, Ash. You take care. I'll see you soon. Dramatic. Look at them working. Look how busy they are. Pondering. They share tacos for lunch and burritos. And that's why I also still have it. Citadel embassies. What's up? Like some random side quests. Oh, and let's pretend I'm not uh, sneaking in. Oh, there you go, got it. Oh, hey, let's talk to you. Some information there. The current human ambassador is Dominic Osoba. Commander Bailey is the CSEC officer on duty. You will find him in the Citadel Security District Office. Lovely. Any other important areas I should know about? The Normandy is currently docked in D24, which is tagged to your biometrics. Docking bay E24 has been repurposed into temporary housing to accommodate the recent influx of civilians to the Citadel. For medical needs, the Presidium offers leading-edge care at the Huerta Memorial Hospital. The Presidium Commons have been a cultural mainstay since the Council was first established at the Citadel. You don't say. Where's the Spectre Requisitions Office? The Spectre Requisitions District Office is down the hallway to your left. Lovely. Note that requisition forms are available only to agents whose biometrics are verified and on file. No, I'm still a Spectre. Should be fine. What else is in the area? This area is reserved for human embassy personnel and attending CSEC security. 
The human embassy prides itself on offering swift assistance to any who fall under its auspices. And that's why we have a salary that's band it. to ask. Please speak with me. Probably cheaper. Maybe this is a CSAC station. Who knows, really? Yeah, let's go. There is no anti-humanity conspiracy here, Ms. Al Jelani. The council's simply not granting interviews at this time. My viewers are going to know that CSAC and the council are denying them access. Listen, lady, you think I like playing gatekeeper between the paparazzi and the politicians? I don't have time to babysit them, and I'm not here to hold your hand. 